Hello, welcome to today's topic on the right to good housing. The right to good housing is a universal human right. It means that everybody in the whole world has the right to own a good house. Good housing is more than a house with four walls and a roof. Good housing means a house that is safe and dry. A good house it's a house that is properly built and it's always safe and dry. First, we can ask, does everyone have the right to housing? Should housing be a human right? Today, we are going to discuss all this in the course of today's lesson. First, let's look at the meaning of a house. A house is a place where people live. A house is a place where people live. We have various types of houses, mud house, tilt house, block house, cement house. Even animals have where they live. Okay, you have the lions live in the den. You have the birds in the nest. Some of the lizards stay in different uh, cracks in the wall. Every individual has the right to a good housing. So we have said that a house is a place where people live. Moving on, we are going to look at the meaning of inhabitants. Inhabitants are people who live in a house. So people who live in a particular house, they are called inhabitants. So inhabitants of a house are people who live in a house. Now, in the course of pursuits of our life, freedom, happiness, in the course of hustling, in the course of moving around, we need a roof over our head. Meaning of a good housing. Good housing means a household that is safe, dry, and big enough to accommodate all its inhabitants. So that good housing is the one that is safe, dry, and can accommodate all its inhabitants. Types of houses. We have huts, bungalows, duplex, houses built on stilts and water. We have story buildings. We even have houses made of mud, clay, bricks. Um, we have raffias. We have houses built with woods. Now, can you see the image of a bungalow? There's a silt house below, houses built in water, okay, with woods. Then you have the mud house. Then you have houses, story building. Most of these houses are found in the city, especially the story building and the bungalows. Then you find the huts in the villages. So it's advisable that humans should invest into good housing. Man should build houses that are durable, houses that are safe, dry, and comfortable. Reasons why Nigerian citizens do not enjoy their right to good housing. We're going to look at the reasons why Nigerian citizens do not enjoy their right to good housing. First, a lot of things are involved. The country is prone to bad government, corruption, embezzlement. Okay, and so most Nigerians don't have hope of having any good housing from the government. Another reason is that some houses are poorly built, they have cracks, most of them are collapsing, and it might lead to shock. Okay, electrical faults that may lead to shock. Now, housing problems in Nigeria. One is homelessness, the other one is slums, the third one is overcrowding. Homelessness. This is when people do not have a house to live because they cannot afford one. You can see the image before you. This woman is living in a shank. Okay, this environment is not healthy. This cannot be called a good housing system. Okay, this is as good as a trash environment a dirty environment okay it looks like a slum so homelessness is when people do not have a house to live because they can't afford it this is a slum environment what are slums this is an area of a city that is overcrowded dirty and not well arranged we have some slum areas in nigeria like the ajegunle area in lagos we have some environments too even in our neighborhood that are slums Overcrowding. This is when too many people squeeze into a room or house to live together. Overcrowding is when, if you watch very closely, you can see these persons that they are packed together in this room and there is no enough space. And this kind of thing could lead to health problem. 
What is privacy? This is the right to be left alone. Citizens have the right to privacy. So everyone have the right to privacy. Nobody have the right to intrude into your privacy. Finally, we all have rights to privacy and rights to good housing. Thanks for watching this video and please do ensure to upload your video assignment. Be good.